This is a Rise 360 course I'm working on. Um, has, it's pretty customized. Um, this is the cover, oh, which I like a lot. I see the main image kind of keeps the focus on the, uh, the f focal point. It's the airplane there. And we have custom custom page titles. But anyway, this this video is about this. This is a multiple choice question. And I'm gonna turn off this theme component here. You can see that's the original, just multiple choice. You click one, it's either right or wrong. And I thought, how could we turn this into a graphical question? Okay, you can see I just got that one wrong. All I'm doing with this theme component is putting in a background image and then restyling the choices. It's pretty simple. Uh, gonna, that should be the correct answer. You can see I've got my feedback there. I can take it again or uh, uh, move on with the rest of the course. Uh, and it's nice and responsive, of course. Uh, which you can't really do this in in storyline uh, I love how responsive the, the lessons are in, in Rise and this is just a little modification uh, if you look at the CSS for this item and I am I'm zeroing in on the the block ID that's how you can have this apply to only one of the uh, of the quizzes instead of all of them obviously you wouldn't want to repeat this over and over uh, but I'll provide the uh, CSS for it and the SCSS I'll probably provide that too that's a little uh, uh, shorter when, when you look at the overall code but uh, when I'm previewing these theme components live uh, I can't use SCSS uh, but yeah, any questions, uh, I'll put this on the uh, Theme360 site. If you want to use it with your own images, you'll be able to grab the code and throw it into a theme component.